yes today it's all about spoons you know you during every stage of life we are the well offs and those who don't put in their efforts they are always spoon fed during our childhood days we are spoon fed using the right kind of spoons the small spoons and when you grow up we catch up with the same spoon feeding through a bigger spoon and ultimately we are we rely on being spoon fed even when you are grown up so this spoon feeding is a dangerous trend because it deprives us of being independent while we are in the childhood if we are made to realize to be independent and to you know to manage our own things how do we you know uh, manage our lives with our own skills and talents and uh, hard work and determination we no longer need to be spoon fed and this continues and we don't require different levels of spoons different sizes of spoons to be spoon fed during the as we age and this you know this dangerous trend of being spoon fed you know makes us to be reliant on others to be you know we are deprived of being independent we are we are deprived deprived of being creative being innovative we are because we are spoon fed we get all that we want at the you know uh, you know at a um, whatever we wish we get it uh, easily so this is called spoon feeding we don't uh, we we are not uh, uh, you know used to struggle in life to get something that we want we get it easy when we get easily what we want in a platter of uh, uh, plate we are you no know, not using our knowledge and wisdom and our own efforts and our own um, uh, way of getting what we want through our hard work and determination every stage of life you can see the small spoon right from the childhood we are you no know, spoon fed so this is a classic lesson but there are some people who are the from hand to mouth who live from hand to mouth they don't rely upon any other person other than themselves they do the hard work they do the determination and they eat what they earn through their hard work they do all the work on their own they do they do change the things they want to change in the society they be the change makers in the society they are the transformers and they are not they don't rely upon being spoon fed right from the childhood if they are being trained in this way to be the change makers and transformers and to use their creativity and innovation and hard work and determination they are the leaders of the, the next generation and they become the change makers without being spoon fed thank you